Sunshine, how are you doing? How are you doing today? I'm doing great now that I'm here with you. I do enjoy so much sharing this time with conversation and showing you all the neat things I found on Timu and hopefully you can get some ideas for things or see things you like. Remember, everything that I have shown you will be linked at the bottom. So just scroll down there, follow your link, as well as my associates code, where you will get first time users will get 50% off their first order and a coupon bundle for $100. Now, don't feel bad if you've already on Timo. You can use my code and also get a $100 bundle worth of coupons. So it's really great. And, and Timo is a wonderful, wonderful place to shop if you are on a budget or just anybody. But I will tell you, Timu, for those of you that don't know what it is, it's an online marketplace. They have thousands and thousands of vendors. It's, it's like Amazon, but about a third of the price. And they've got just about everything except for perishable foods that you would want. I mean, it's amazing. My husband will tell me to get something. I'll, he'll, of course, go on Amazon. I checked Timu and boy, we got a better price. So, love my Timu. Well, today, before we start this haul, I want to again tell you thank you for your comments. They're helping me out a lot. I'm still waiting on my stand so I can have my microphone different and my lights a little different. But be patient with me. I'm on going on my first full week. So I hit week two in a few days. So, and I'm so happy to see my new subscribers and all the comments to help me get there. I really appreciate it. So if you're like me and you like my content, please hit that subscribe button. Now, today I have on my Timu earrings and I have a little pink sundress on. Now this little sundress came in a three pack. There was a gray one, a black one, and a pink one. And they're just lightweight and they're so comfortable and cool especially in these 90 plus degree days that we've been seeing so before we start with our haul i want to make sure that everybody knows how to get money on timu there are things called credit adjustments there are things called free items cart specials percent specials there's all kinds of ways and i'm just not sure you know all of them i'm just learning all of them so I'm going to hope this doesn't make a glare. I've got, there we go, there we go. All right, when you're on your home Timu screen, what you want to do is hit the little person figure, and it's going to bring you up to your menu. Now, for a credit adjustment, you want to click on the icon up here that says your orders, okay? It's going to pull you up with all your orders. Oh, boy, I know, I have quite a few. I love Timu. With four children, six grandchildren, my goodness, where else would I shop? So, you just scroll up through all your orders and see what's going on. Then, you go into your orders. Now, what you want to do is here, hit that dollar amount. Did I hit it? Did I hit it? Yeah, I hit it. Yeah. It's hard to see something. <laughs> so, I'm trying to help y'all out. All right, you'll see through here, you have the links of refund, shipping, reviews, and that. But see this line? Credit adjustments. So you want to hit credit adjustment it's going to pull up and it's going to tell me I get a credit adjustments on these two items I purchased so down here at the bottom it asks me to request my credit adjustment of course I'm going to request it's money back yeah going right I am so this is telling me how much I'm going to get do I want to send it to my Timu credit which I usually do because I do a lot of shopping on Timu so I just sent it to the credit or you can send it back to your original purchaser. And it goes back in your bank account, credit card, however you used it. You're going to hit submit. And this tells me that I had $3.53 just on that one order put in my credit balance. So then you're going to hit back. One, two. Should be two. There we go. And then it takes me to my main screen saying I have $3.91. So I had a few pennies in there. And they're for opening boxes and different things. They give you credit. Remember to open your treasure chest. So let me tell you where you find it about your treasure chest. It gives you money. You're going to go up here in messages. Hit messages. Now, 
I have one on my credit balance that tells me they've transferred the $3.53 into my account. I'm going to back out of there. And then this one is on shipping. And this is telling me that they've given me a price adjustment on my item. They tell me this was order was shipped. Complete checkout. So, but you always want to check your messages because you see the top promotions. That's what they see in your treasure chest. And just for opening a treasure chest, you get two cents. You think two cents? Four treasure chests, eight cents. That adds up. At least cover your tax to help you out. I'm sorry about the glare of my light. I so do apologize. So we're going to back out of here. We're back to our main menu. Now, if you come down to here, you'll see a place that says Earn Credits and Free Gifts. Hit the Earn Credits and Free Gifts. Now, this is going to bring you to all your games. Whoops, what did I hit? Didn't mean to hit. Let's back arrow out of there. And put me in a game but we'll go over the games in another video because I do play fish land and farmland and you do win lots of nice prizes one has a $40 value the other has a $30 value but they're nice prizes and we will get to that because I have a video coming up that's gonna be gifts Christmas gift birthday gifts anniversary gifts all kinds of gifts and I'm gonna show you some of the things that I have won in those games so what you're going to do is scroll all the way down here at the bottom where it says Timu Exclusive. I wasn't sure of the wording. Sorry about that. <laughs> so I'm going to hit there. All right. Now what you see, first of all, I usually start down here at the bottom. All right. What this is, is it gives you an additional, oh, that glare, additional 3%. It goes up to 10%. It just depends on your phone, your order content. Mine's 3%, so I'm going to hit apply. And it's going to apply the 3% to everything in my cart that meets their qualifications. So I get even more of a discount. Now you can shop on this page. Go through and shop on this page. Sorry, mine's taking a little bit to load. And then I'm going to back out of here. Now, we're going to go up to here to Cart Special. We're going to hit Apply. Now, this is going to tell me that already in my cart, I have, let's see, several items. Look at this. Several items. Three, six, nine. Nine items that meet their qualifications, and I'm going to get an additional discount on. So, hit Got It. All right. Then, you come down here, Go to Spend. So, you're going to hit Go to Spend. And it's going to spin, and it's going to give you an extra discount on something in your cart. So I had something that cost $2.25. Now I get 20 per, additional 20% off, so it's only $1.98. I'm going to click Got It. So now I have those discounts. You're going to back out of there. Now, up here, you have coupons, different coupons that you can pick. So you can just choose which coupon you want. And then you come further up, and it shows you a credit balance. I have a credit balance of $24.70. Okay. This bottom, this was $0.20. Cent. You can't get that because it hasn't been shipped yet. But this, I have that much money I can transfer back to my credit adjustments. So we're going to hit transfer. I have $24.50. But watch what happens. Hit transfer. And it transferred $13.91. There is a maximum that you can transfer. And this says credit balance that use. So I'm going to hit shop now. So now you see this went to $14.50. Now this is that percentage you get at the bottom off of everything you buy. Back. 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 Scroll up. And now my credit balance is $13.91. And when you do a purchase and close out, it automatically takes this money first before it takes anything off your credit card or your bank account or Google Pay, however you have it set up. So that's a neat little thing. 
to help us out and give us a few extra pennies. But be sure to go in there at the bottom and, and click that extra percentage. And make sure you're checking your price adjustments to get your refunds. So, today we have a good haul. I've got a variety of everything from kitchen things to gifts to clothes to Halloween to Christmas. So, we're just going to have a good old time. So thank you very much, and let's begin. All right, the first thing I'm gonna show you is this little kitchen utility knife. Look at this thing. Comes in a nice little case, handles a good weight, good weight. I mean, just fits my hand so comfortably. That, let me tell you, is a sharp blade. Look at that, beautiful blade. I use this for cutting all my vegetables. I mean, this is just a wonderful little knife. Now this little knife was $9.49 when I bought it, but I happen to see now it's been reduced and it's a lot cheaper. But it's a real nice little knife, little weight, perfect. And the next video you see of mine, we will be in the kitchen cooking and I will be using this little utility knife. So, now the next thing we have is a little tea maker. Look at that, isn't that so cute? Look at that little Nessie, isn't that so cute? Now the reason I got this one is because I, Nessie has a spoon, they have a big soup spoon, ladle spoon, that has the same long handle, and they also have a strainer spoon that has the same long handle. But this is just flexible. What you do is you take the top off, it's got the little straining holes, you put your tea in here, and you put your top back on, there you go, and then you just put it in your teacup. It does sit on the counter straight. I don't know if you can see that, but it does. It has little feet, and it will sit on the counter. I mean, it looks cute just sitting on the counter. But you do your tea, soak it. By the time it's finished, just pull it up. Now, what I like about this one is when you're pulling it up and you finish soaking your tea, you can actually squeeze this because it is soft to get that last little residual amount of your tea, which they say is the best flavor because that's what's soaked in there. So this little thing was $3.99. But it's real cute. Little Nessie tea strainer. Alright, the next thing I'm going to show you, for those of you that like sushi, it's a sushi roller. Now, I have a grandson that loves sushi. And I love sushi. So, I thought we'd try this out. Now, this was $4.27. Let's see what's in here. Mm. Alright, let's see what we have. Alright, we have direction. Oh, we have recipes. That is so nice that they give you recipes. So for those who are just beginning and basically know a Philly roll and a California roll, there are some recipes. So that's real cute. Now, I'm not sure how this contraption works, but it looks like this fits somehow. And you put your rice in or put your seaweed paper, whatever you want to use, however you want to have the outside, and put it in here. Close this up, and I don't know if this turns around or rotates it. I'm not sure. And then, well, if you put this in here, it looks like you just pull this up, and it would roll it and get it tight. So, but again, I'm not sure how to work it. I'll have to read the instructions and figure that out. But I'm sure my grandson would love to do that. So, and again, just a little sushi roll maker. Again, this was four dollars and twenty-seven cents. Now, the next thing I'm going to show you is something you can use in your oven. You can use it on the grill. Look at this. Look at this. A rack. And this is a sturdy rack. I mean, I can't bend it. I can't bend it. It sits on the. You either put it in the oven on a cookie sheet or sit it right on the grill. But what this is, this is a chicken rack. Now, this rack cost six dollars and forty-seven cents. But what you do is you take the little drumettes from your chicken legs and you squeeze them in and lock them in each of this position. So this will hold two, four, six, twelve chicken legs at one time. So if you're having a barbecue, great. Don't have to worry about flipping it because the juice is naturally dripped down and they make it so moist. The, the meat is so moist and juicy. But this also gets your skin crispy a little bit. I, I don't like a soggy skin. I must admit, I do not like a soggy skin. So this is perfect for that. So I just thought this was just so neat. So, in fact, I think I'll try it out this week. <laughs> now, the next thing 
I want to show you is what you saw on my front page. This little thing. And what is this little thing? Well, the package says Nicore, but this has no nicotine in it. But I'm going to tell you, this would be the best dollar and 34 cent you ever bought. I use one currently that's in mint. Now, if you have seasonal allergies or a little sinus infection coming on, <clears throat> excuse me, you just take this, and this one is, oh, this one's peach. That smells so good. And you just inhale it. Now, you remember the old Vicks inhalers, or am I really showing my age? I'm probably really showing my age. But the old Vicks inhaler that your grandmother used to always give you when you got a little cold, a little sniffle, a little sinus thing going on. Well, this is the same concept. Mm -hmm. It has a scent in it. And the scent opens up your head. It opens up your sinuses. I mean, this little thing is wonderful. $1.34. And it comes in mint watermelon grape this peach and something else but like i said i use the mint and it really helps open up my head and it's drug free caffeine free nicotine free drug free i mean it's just a wonderful natural alternative so the next thing i'm going to go to is a gift now this is a great gift idea look at this nice box but look what you get in it what it is you get three bracelets now this is for men. Nice leather, plastic beads, and a leather bracelet. Now this is all a new craze. What I'm told by my 15 year old grandson. And look at this. Look at this watch. This is a suede. Yeah, I call it suede, but look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that beautiful blue face with that silver. So what you do, I'm gonna pretend I'm my grandson. You put your bracelets on, and you can put them on all by yourself. They tighten with just the string. Let's pull the string, and then we've got this little leather bracelet. It's got a little ID like band on. It's real cute. All right, so we've got our bracelets on, and you put your watch on. Look at that. Is that not so cool? Is that not so cool? Now, you know men now are wearing more bracelets, and they love these leather bracelets. You say watches. Most people have phones. That's true. But my grandson specifically asked for a watch. He said, watches are in now, Grandma. So I said, okay, baby. So there you go. And you're not going to believe what the price of a watch and one, two, three bracelets. $2.88. Look at that. I mean, you get the perfect little gift box. Nice box. Nice watch. Got your leather bracelets. I mean, wonderful, wonderful. $2.88. Amazing, isn't it? I just thought that makes such a nice gift. Now, let's move to the teenage granddaughter. I saw this. Now, I've been seeing these everywhere. Look at this. It's a speaker. But what makes this speaker so special? Let's see. Look at this. It's an earbud. Look at that. Look at that. It's an earbud. Isn't that amazing? Now it comes with your charging cord. And it comes with directions. Directions are in English. And you just charge it up. And it's got buttons over here for volume up, down, bass. All kinds of things, and there's your on-off switch, and there's your charging port, and you can see the mesh. This is where the speaker comes out. But isn't that just the cutest thing? That you just sit it down, and you got an earbud speaker. Teenagers gonna eat this up. I'm telling you, they're gonna eat that up. But I thought that was just so cute, and that earbud was fifteen eighty eight. But I was looking through Timu this morning, and did see one for nine ninety eight. So just Check it out. Your butt speakers that have upside down. Your butt speakers. Now this comes, they come in blue, yellow, green, pink, white, and black. But I just got a white one. I thought that'd be universal. She could put it in any room, take it in any room. So I thought that was really, really cute. Now the next thing is a gift for my daughter-in-law. It's a keychain. You say, what? What is that big old keychain? Well, this keychain comes with a lot of things. 
All right, start off with your classic little keychain, soft, fuzzy ball. Now this comes in other colors too, black, pink, red, blue. I got black because she happens to like black. All right, and what you get is another little keychain. Nice little faux leather pouch. And what it has in it is a little bottle. Put your hand sanitizer in. So you got your hand sanitizer in. You got this. You got your pom pom. Comes with a little faux leather handle to be the main handle which you put everything on. And then you've got a little contraption here. I'm not sure what all the tools are, what they can be used for. But little, and this is metal. I mean, this is metal. This is not bendable. So it comes with little tools on the end. And it's got this that I'm not sure exactly what it's for. It's got a little slot in, but I'm not sure exactly what's that for. Then we have another little tool. Look at this. Now it's a bottle opener. Use that as a screwdriver. So, real neat little tool. And this is perfect for women and children. Look at that. A whistle. Now, how many times have you been in a parking lot at Walmart at night and gotten leery and just held your keys tight and wondered, well, you got a little security whistle. Now, look at this. This is, I really like. That's a little panic button. You got the speaker built in here, and it's also a little flashlight. Now, I don't want to push that button because I don't want to make no panic noise and have my dog barking and my husband hollering, what's going on? <laughs> I'm going to think I'm being mugged in my office. I'll tell you. And then we've got this. Oh, this must be special. It's in a bag. Okay. It comes with a little key ring. What is this contraption? Well, I see a blade. So let's take this off. Ooh. All right. You've got a blade in here. I like the old style letter openers. Kind of, sort of. Oh, here's your point. Look at this. This is one of those point special points. If you get locked out of your car and say something's in it, you need to break your window or you're trapped in your car and something happens. You just use that, tap on the window, and it'll break the glass so you can get out safely. So that's real neat. And it does, it has a little ring. And, oh, here are these directions that tell us what all these tools are for. Mm-hmm. Directions tell you what the gadgets are for and how to process that. So I thought that was real cute. Now this was nine dollars and thirty-seven cents. And again, like I said, it comes in all different colors. But look at this: you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight things hang on your keychain, and you get a nice little keychain. Nice gift, nine dollars and thirty-nine cents. Now the next thing I want to talk about is this little bottle. I'm doing nails. For some of you that saw my nail video, thank you for watching and commenting. And if you haven't, check it out. Just give you a tutorial on how to manicure your nails and your cuticles and put on these fake nails that I use. And a beautiful set. I just put this set on in the video. Beautiful set. I love wearing nails, but I've started experimenting with the um, powders and dipping. So I wanted to check this out. This is supposed to be the miracle solution to get the powders off. And so just the same stuff they use in the salon is from that set. It's called Nail Flowers Monomer. It's by Jada Tips. And this little bottle was $2.69. So I will try it out and I will let you know how it works. Let's hope it works good. I don't want to try on nails and make a mess and then can't get it off because I'm still learning. But once I get them refined, then we'll do a video on those to show you those because I would love to see a video right now to help me out. All right, the next thing we have is this. My husband calls me a crazy gardener. I have an herb garden. And now, I'm going to have a catnip garden. Yes, this is for catnip. Got your little tray, nice sturdy plastic. Put your dirt, put your seeds. I've ordered some catnip seeds, so I'm excited about them coming in. Put your little tray down, water it through here. Now, catnip, for those of you who don't know, it's just like grass. So it's basically going to look like I'm growing a little tray of grass. 
but it's catnip. I have two cats and they love catnip. I've bought the little balls that you stick on the deck, the rolling balls of the catnip. They love it. So I thought we'd try real catnip. And this was $3.87. So I thought that was something we could try. I like trying new gadgets and new little things. You never know what you find. This may be a gem in the rough. So, the next thing, all of you have seen the diamond art. Whoops, sorry about that. <laughs> I'm just going to cover up screen so you can't see nothing. I'm going to hide all this stuff from you. The next thing is the little DIY diamond kits. I picked up these two for my granddaughters. Now, the reason I picked up these two patterns because they have fairy necklaces on them. And both of these are necklaces that I have ordered for my granddaughter. Now in the kit, you've got a little tray, a little thing of wax, and a little pen to use. I'll be honest with you, I don't know that my grandchildren use these little pens. I bought one that has a light and a magnifying glass on. Stuff small for me. Look at these little beads. Look at the colors you get. Look at these little beads. Get the glare off. Pretty blues. Oh, that's pretty. Look at those blues and grays. Now, let's look at the picture. And again, this is a fairy necklace, and you can just type in fairy necklaces and it'll play up design that I bought for my granddaughter. They have this matching necklace. Isn't she pretty? Look at all the blues and silvers and how sparkly those wings are going to be. That is just gorgeous. And this was $2.49. And you get everything. So I thought that was a good deal. Now, the other one I got is again, the same necklaces, but in fairy necklaces. All right. All right, this kit comes with the tray. Comes with all the different color beads. See the colors? Oh, I got glare. The colors, beautiful colors. And look at this design. Look at this. Isn't she beautiful? Look at that little Indian princess. Isn't she pretty? I love her. They're going to have such fun making those. She is gorgeous. And this one was also $2.49. Oh, it's a wonderful craft project. My grandchildren worked on those during the summer, and they just had a blast. My one granddaughter made one with a cat that was so gorgeous. And I bought her a frame. Timmy does sell the frames for them, and it's a little magnetic frame was the one I bought her, and she has that up, and it, it's just gorgeous. Now, those of you that have seen my other hauls know what I think of Timmy's socks. They are quality. They are nice. They have a feature that I haven't seen on any other socks. First, little cow prints. Look at that. Sweet milk. Look at these. Aren't those so now these socks were $1.79, nice stretchy, wonderful elastic at the tops. But what I like about these so much is look at this, see? See how the back, where the heel is and rubs in the sneakers when they run and whatnot. Look at that little cow, can you see that little cow, isn't he so cute? So I'm really excited about those. She loves cows, she's gonna love those. And for $1.79 for two pair, can't beat it. Now I have, Another grandson that plays guitar. So I thought I'd pick up these socks for him. But these are men's socks. Look at that. They have little guitars on them. Aren't they cute? And again, great quality socks. Reinforced toe. Strong heel. And look at this top. Look at this top. Look at this. I mean the quality of the material. These socks are great and they have all kinds from movie characters to cartoon characters. I mean they just have all kinds of socks. In fact these next ones I'm not going to tell you what they are. I will tell you they cost a dollar and seventy cents. I will tell you that they have beautiful reinforced red toes, red heel, the top Wonderful. Look at that. I mean, these are not going to slouch down on you. These are great socks. Let's see if you can figure out who this is. Put my hand down in here. Shape it up a little bit for you. Who's that? Darth Vader. Is that not cool? Now, what Star Wars fan would not want Darth Vader socks? I'm telling you, they've got socks for everything. 
everything. They're just so cute. But Darth Vader socks for $1.70. Amazing. Now, for those who have seen my other videos, know that me and my grandchildren wear Crocs. And I love to collect Croc charms. Now, this is a bag of 20 Croc charms. This is $2.99. But the theme, whoops, the theme is music. Look at that. Little music notes. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Perfect. A little guitar. A little guitar. What else we got? Huh. Vinyl record. Oh, look at this one. Look at this one. I'm not quite that old. I'm close. Whoops, I got it upside down. <laughs> a little Victrola. Now, these are your standard crop charms. They have the peg. And they just fit in the shoes as well as the croc holders. In my previous video, I hauled a croc holder, and it's just great. That way, you don't have to store these things in bags and try to go through the bags. You put them in the holder, and everything just laid right out. So, if you're interested in that, please check out my other videos, and I'll show you how to use that, how it works, and how easy it is to display all your croc charms. And again, $2.99. We all know how much croc charms are. Now, this are special crop charms. Let me get these out very carefully. And I'll tell you why I'm getting them out carefully. There you go. Alright. Got a little fox. Look at a little fox. Got a little turtle. King of crop charms. Ah, they light up. So when the kids walk, they're going to flash. Look at that. Is that not too cool? I saw this and I said, yes. And I got these two for $1.39. Again, standard crop charm. So, you say, what do we put all these crop charms in? Well, I'm not Judy Rockefeller. So, what I've done is I bought my grandchildren each a pair of the crop dupes. And let me tell you about this little shoe. Look at this. Look at this. Looks just like them. Look at that. Got your sports strap in the back. And these are good. Look at these. Look at these. And they are so soft. The foam is wonderful in these things. And they hold all the charms. You just put them in. Put it in the holes. And twist them a little bit to get it in there. And look at this beautiful fox right on the front. Oops, that seems to be difficult. And that's what happens when you have long nails. <laughs> Things are always harder when you have long nails, aren't they? But there we've got the little fox lighting up on the shoe. Look at that. Is that not adorable? My grandchildren have a white pair each and a black pair each. And those little crocs are $5.48. Look at that deal. $5.48. And they're great. They're great for them to wear. And they're so soft. The cushion on the bottom is so soft. They're so comfortable to walk in. Now, the next thing I'm going to show you, I have for my granddaughter. Now, tell me this is not a deal. $10.67. And look what you get. Look what you get. Fall coming up. Perfect. Look at this. Whoops. It's a little jumper. Oh, look at that. It's just a simple little jumper. But if you look, the cut is shaped. And you see that shape cut? I'm trying to hold it up so you can see the shape cut. Yeah. Little jumper. It'll come right about above her knees. The material is wonderful. Wonderful. Let's see what it's made out of. Let's see what it's made out of. Well... This one may not tell me. I don't see a tag. Oh, goodness. Oh, here's a little tag. Does it tell me what? Nope, just tells me the size. This one is in women's, and it's a 10. It's a large. It's a 10, 12. But not only do you get the jumper for $10.67, but look at this. You get a little white shirt to go with it. Nice rounded collar. Reinforced collar. Look at that stitching. 
long sleeves, and the sleeves have the cuff at the end. Isn't that cute? They have a nice cuff. So I think that's adorable. So for ten dollars and not sixty-seven cents, where are you going to get a shirt and a jumper? I mean, that's just a great deal. So I bought her one a maroon shirt and jumper in one of my previous hauls. So you need to check that out too. Now, next thing we want to do is talk about a little kitchen cleaning. Now I know everybody's seen the angry mama. Well, here we go. There she is in all her glory. Isn't she cute? Flat bottom. Good, strong plastic. And you're not going to bend it. You take her head off. And what you do, now some people use just water. I put a little vinegar in with my water. But you fill it up with the solution you want. You don't need to put soap or anything like that. Just water or something light like that. Pop the top on. Stick it in the microwave. I used to stick mine in there for about five minutes. I didn't come with any directions, so I just basically looked at the comments and different things on Timu to figure out that. And then on the top, where she has all the holes, the steam comes out, softens everything, cleans everything in the microwave, where you can just take a paper towel and wipe it out. No scrubbing anymore. <laughs> Isn't that great? No scrubbing. My husband loves to spider. Look at that. And this was $2.88. Now, what do we have? Do we have, I guess we call that one the angry mama. We call this one the stinky mama. Look at her. Isn't she cute? Look at her holding her nose. Isn't <laughs> she so cute? She's so cute. Again, the hard plastic, good strong base. What you do with this one is you take the head off. You have your chamber. Now, what I'm currently doing is using baking soda. And doesn't that look a lot cuter than putting baking soda box in there, which was I've done for years. One in the freezer, one in the refrigerator. But I thought this was just too cute. And this is $2.68. Isn't she cute? Look at the little face. So just a way to keep things fresh and keep them on. And then have something cute sitting in there. Now, let's move a little bit to Halloween. We all know Halloween's coming up. Now, at Halloween, we have pizza parties. What better way to cut your pizza than with an axe? Look at that. Can you believe that? Nice wooden handle. Rolls very nicely. Good sturdy plastic. So go into your Halloween party and cut your pizza with an axe. Isn't that cute? Now tell me that wouldn't start a conversation. I told you I love all these little unique gadgets. And this little pizza cutter is $2.58. It comes in black and it comes in red. Isn't that cute? So, grandkids are going to have a party with pizza. I thought that was so cute. Now, this and all of you are going to know this character. Let's see. Let's see. They pack things very nice. You can see the box is mushed up. It's bent. But that's what Tima has to come from China and fly on an airplane and go through customs and we repack so we know what our boxes look like when they get to us. But look at this. $6.49. And I mean, this is good material. It, it's a heavy little ornament. Sits flat, sits on the table. But look at the detail on that. Isn't that so cute? Look at that. Even got his little bunny knife. Look at that. And then that can look cute with any Halloween table decor. Isn't that cute? And again, this was $6.47. So I thought that was a real neat addition to the Halloween table with the Axe Pizza Cutter. Now, another thing we do, because sometimes you can't always find the designer shirts or the shirts with the designs or mottos in your size. So what I do is I buy a t-shirt and this t-shirt was two dollars, was four dollars, I'm sorry, this t-shirt was five dollars and eighty-seven cents. Now this happens to be a 2X. Now I know this is that 100% polyester. Nice collar. Stitching detail on the collar. Short sleeves. And it is a little stretchy. 
but it's lightweight. It's a very lightweight material. So, I've ordered just a plain black t-shirt. Or you can get it in red, orange, yellow, green, whatever color you want to get into it. But what I do with it is I pay my little dollar and 79 cent and I get a transfer. Now look at this transfer and tell me this is not adorable. Look at this. I'm going to turn this way so you read it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Got her hair up. All the horror characters. Look at that. All the horror characters are in there. And you come up to her glasses. Now, can you see in her glasses the horror characters? Isn't that so neat to have Michael Myers in your glasses? And it says down here, horror lighted. So, it's a transfer. And these transfers are very use, easy to use, and they iron on perfectly on the polyester shirts. So I thought that was really neat. So that's what I do when the kids say, Grandma, I want this shirt. And I'm like, I can't find it in their size. What do I do? Go to transfers. They have lots of cute, cute transfers. And this one, huge one, beautiful color, $1.79. So I was real happy about that. Now, let's move to a little Christmas stuff. All right. First thing that I got is a dollar and ninety-eight cent. Now this comes in a multitude of colors, but look at that little Christmas elf. Isn't that cute? Reminds me of the ones back in the fifties and sixties. Like it's got that nostalgia look on it. Little shoes, and it does bend, so you can sit it. Little shoes. Look at those little cute hands. Aren't they so cute? Uh -huh collar. All this is felt. But isn't that cute? So I got it just to sit it around with my Christmas decorations. I still have my elf on the shelf that I use, but I thought this would be cute just to add to decor. So I got that one. Then I got this box. Ooh, what's in this box? This box actually looks good for a TV box. I don't see it bent up. <laughs> it's not raggedy. Oh my goodness, it's not raggedy. What do we have? Oh, yeah, I forgot about this. Look at this. Who is that? Look at that. The Grinch. Isn't that so cute? Now, that was $6.29. But look at the detail on this. Look at the detail. And this is a good, strong ornament. This is not a plastic ornament. Look at the detail. Got your stocking with your tree and gifts in it. Presents all around. Look at that. And that's the Grinch. And that's so cute. Six dollars and twenty-nine cent. It's got the little hanger here. Now it doesn't come with the string to hang it, so that's something you'd have to add. But I'm sure in every craft box you have string, golden thread to put it on, or you could just use a regular hook. You don't need to add that. And the next thing I got. Was I collect angels, and closer we get to Christmas, when I start decorating, you'll see. But look at her, is she not cute? Look at that. Look at that. She's got little silver stars sparkling in her dress, a little heart. With the, look at that. And she's just so cute. And this is the fur, the faux fur, the little feathers up here. But little angel. Little beach down here. Does that not look antique? I mean, I just love old school. I'm old school. I love old school. But this little angel was a dollar and ninety-seven cent. Beautiful, beautiful. Now you already know I have two cats because we're doing that now. So. And I do have two of these. Before you comment and get me, I do have two. These are stockings for the cats. Are you ready for this? You're not ready. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> it looks like a little fish. You got your opening up here. Now this is a good, thick digit material. This is going to hold a lot of treats and canned cat food and whatnot. Same print, front and back. Little hanger. So, I have a kitty stocking. I have two kitty stockings. And these stockings were $5.58. 48 cents. I'm sorry, $5.48. 
But with this material, and as heavy as this is, and as well constructed as this is, this is going to last you. You're not going to have to buy another one. This is something you want to pack away and use Christmas after Christmas. So I thought that was real cute. Now this next thing I need your help with. I'm not sure what to do with it. I don't know whether I should just put stuff in it and stick it around my tree for decoration. Whether I should get more and fill them up for the kids for their Christmas presents. I haven't decided, so I need your help. Okay. It's a canvas bag. Look at that. North Pole Post Office Reindeer Express Service. Overnight delivery. Do not open before December 25th. Look at that. Please deliver to, so you can write their name on here at the bottom, if you give it to someone as a gift or a child as a gift to put all their gifts in a big Santa bag. This is a real heavy, heavy canvas. Heavy canvas. Stitched well, made well. You have the drawstring top. So you can Dry it up, and then you do your gift, and have it sitting by the tree or filled with gifts. So, let me know. What should I do? Should I sit it by the tree, or should I put the grandchildren's gifts in there? I haven't quite decided. I need your help, so send me some comments and let me know what to do. What do you think I should do? Now, this last gift is a Wi-Fi camera. Now, I specifically got this for the side of my house. Because I have the old-fashioned screw-in. It comes with the mounting. So this can be rewired. And screw it in. You got your mount. Now this light turns all the way around. It rotates. It swivels. Now it comes with directions. It's called an HT60 bulb camera. Panoramic 360 degree security Wi-Fi camera. Cover every corner. So isn't that cute? And this was $11.89. And it's made really well. I mean, really well. Really well. So, I thought that was real neat. And easy. Quick little $11.89. And I got a security camera on the side of my house. I'm anxious to get my husband to put that up. Well, that's the end of my haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got some ideas that you can use and see some little things that you want to get. Thank you for coming. If you liked, please subscribe to my channel. I'm on my second week. I haven't quite hit two weeks, so I um, just hit one week, so I'm working on my second week. and. I'm trying to get that 100 subscribers in a month, and I do have a wonderful gift, and I'll show that later in another video. I've got a nice little package together for after my 100th subscriber. We'll draw and we'll pick somebody, and the only rules is you have to be subscribed to my channel. That's it. So leave me a comment. Let me know how things were, and as usual, everybody have a blessed day. Thank you.